went over a lot of the details during the presentation, so I'm just gonna hit high levels. So exterior styling, as you can see, huge, just huge enhancements here, much more aggressive. We talked to our customers, and one thing that we kept hearing was, um, and, and I think the one customer just coined it perfectly and stuck in my head. I want a SUV that I feel confident in. I can take it camping, I can go down the dirt trail, it can get dirty, it might get a few scratches and it's good. Or if I wanna to go to the country club and have a nice dinner, I can take it to the country club and it still looks classy too. So it was a balance between that tough, rugged, capable, and not still nice and classy and night on the town. So I think we've we found that perfect balance here. So in the hood, here in this front area is where we bumped it up about an inch. And then back here in this section here and on the other side, we lowered it about the quarter of an inch. So that kind of flattened it out, beefed it up, and gave it more, um, you know, that the emphasis we were looking for. A few of the key Nissan signature items, you'll see motion, the uh, Motion V grill here. And then we also have the Boomerang LED daytime running lamps. On your platinum grade, you'll have the LED headlamps also. So uh, from a styling perspective, you also will see our exterior mirrors have got the integrated turn signal that's standard for all grades. And then when we get around to the back, I'll cover the items that have changed in the back. So that's the styling from the front. Um, also on the side view, you'll also know uh, that we had the new 18 and 20 inch. So these are the new 20 inch wheels that we have. Dynamically, uh, we covered the engine. So we got the new engine under the hood. We've got all of the dynamic improvements as far as handling, steering, um, tire changes. You'll feel that in the curves. You know, grips the road very well. The ride's comfortable. Um, a little bit of a, uh, the, the engine sound has been tuned. So it just is a, a really fun, fun, I hate to use the word aggressive because we don't want aggressive drivers, but it's a fun aggressive drive. All right, so uh, the new features that they covered. Forward emergency braking, please don't use that today <laughs> unless needed. <laughs> uh, intelligent cruise control, uh, moving object detection, all those great features that everyone's looking for. I, I love the moving object detection at the daycare. It, it just gives you that extra bit of comfort. Uh, moving around to the side. The interior, you might not see as many changes on the interior, but we did what we did do, we feel is very important. And you know, consumers seem to be very happy with our interior, so we didn't want to change too much. But the key things that we changed are small but big impact. We've added illumination to the front console pocket, so now you can see what you have in that pocket. And then the cup holder. We heard back that they couldn't fit their favorite coffee mug in because their handle wouldn't go there. Previously we had two circles, so now we have what we call a dog bone shape, so you have that area in the middle that's open that'll accommodate the coffee mug or um, I've consistently heard the big gulp. So we can accommodate all those key important customer features there. Uh, for platinum grade, we have a new wood tone. And then on SL grade, previously we had uh, the wood tone and we chose to go to more of a metallic sportier trim finish. So if you get an SL, you'll see that. Uh, as Scott said, the same seven passenger seating, easy flex seating with the latch and glide. Um, it's been very popular. Uh, and also in the interior, um, the IT system is new, and you, and you covered that inside. So moving around to the back. So some of the exterior styling cues. You'll see the new tail lamps. We went to more of a prominent red. Previously it was red and white. And also the previous tail lamp really followed the body line, so it was kind of flush to the body. Now you can see that it's more aggressive and protrudes from the body. More stance there. And then on the fascia, Here's where they were talking about, where we squared it off. It used to be very round here. We squared it off to give it a little bit more image there. And then this here, this area here is changed. Uh, the feature on the back is the motion activated lift gate. You got your hands full, key fob in a pocket, a purse. You walk up and just give it a quick kick. It has a couple second, uh, or not a couple second, it has a slight delay. So what that is, it gives you time to step back and get out of the way for it to open. You come in, load your equipment, whatever you know strollers whatever you might have your hands full of so when you're done then it's just another quick kick and it'll close quick kick and come back i probably kicked it too hard that time there we go so it's not a, a forceful it's not you know some it's not like a big long sway that you're going to knock yourself over it's just a very simple kick so that's a new feature